Welcome back. Our team spotlight tonight shines on the Illini Bluffs Tigers softball team. The Tigers are younger this season. They're a little more offensive minded this season, but just like the last two years, they'd love to have an end of the season parade to bring home a state championship trophy. You know, the Illinois State played Bradley in softball a couple weeks ago. On that field, two for ISU, two for Bradley. There were four Illini Bluffs graduates on the field playing Division One softball. Yeah, Illini Bluffs is a bit of a softball factory, aren't they? They've won back-to-back -back state titles, and as J.D. Rocher reports, they're winning different this year, but they're back as a state title contender. The last two Illini Bluffs softball seasons have ended the exact same way, in triumph, lifting a state championship, and now the Tigers are eyeing a third straight title. Oh, for sure. It's always like I would love to be make a three-peat. Like, that's my number one goal. I think it just stays in the back of my mind. And every now and then, I'll just be like, that's our goal. To accomplish that three-peat goal, I'd be you'll have to lean on some youngsters. After graduating a terrific senior class, the Tigers now have multiple freshmen making big contributions. Our freshman group is fantastic. Um, they are not only great athletes, they're great girls. and They've really stepped up. When Illini Bluffs won their back-to-back -back state championships, they were led by some dominant pitching. But now, for the first time in four years, the Tigers are breaking in new pitchers. So they're relying a bit more on the offense. And boy, have the bats responded. They are putting up huge numbers. It's a little different with the flip-flop of having younger pitchers, but our hitters have really stepped up. This is a very special group of hitters. Like there's not many holes in the lineup. One through nine, like we can all drive the ball really well and just get on base. Averaging nearly 10 runs per game to start the season, the Tigers feel that this is the kind of offense that can keep them in any game. It's the type of offense that can carry them to that third straight state title. And if we do allow a couple runs, I have no like worry that we won't just get those runs back the next inning. Our pitchers are only going to get better. So knowing we have the hitting already gives us high hopes. 